If your estate-owned company have an interest score of 500 for two of the five preceding years or are a publicly listed company, then you need a social and ethics committee. Other companies that the Minister of Trade and Industry deems necessary will also be required to have a social and ethics committee if it is in the public interest. Companies who fit the profile of those who need to have social and ethics committees but want to apply for exemption to doing so may do that with the company's tribunal. The tribunal will then inform the CIPC of their decision and if that application is successful, it will be valid for five years. A social and ethics committee must comprise of no less than three directors or prescribed officers of the company, at least one of whom must be a director who is not involved in the day-to-day -day management of the company's business and must not have been so involved within the previous three financial years. The director or person who has not been involved in the day-to-day -day management of the company's business has got to be identified as well as proof thereof shown. The committee's objective is to look after the company's standing in terms of employment equity and broad-based black economic empowerment. It also oversees the contribution of the company to the communities where its activities are predominantly conducted, environmental health and public safety, consumer relationships, as well as labor and employment. For more information or if you still have questions, please do get in touch with us.